Hi, it's Henry again, this time about uh, Kinect device. Kinect is Microsoft's new gaming device for Xbox 360. It has an IR camera and powerful IR laser and on top of that it has an RGB camera. That RGB camera outputs a normal webcam type color picture and IR laser with IR camera outputs depth information for each pixel in the picture. I'm using Kinect as a 3D scanner and I'm scanning my electric motorcycle Ikakiva with it. Uh, it has these curves here and it's pretty difficult to get good scan from, from that surface. I have downloaded various samples from the net and written some of my own software to communicate with the Kinect. It outputs live image on the Mac OS X operating system. Here we have the live image from the Kinect sensor. Let me show you how this works. Kinect stands right here and when I take it to my hand the image is constantly updated in the screen. There we have a live image of the depth information from the Kinect uh, depth sensor. And here is the setup, Kinect and the motorcycle. And now I'm going to grab the image from the sensor. So there we have it. And now we can open uh, just a normal uh, text editor or see the file with the um, terminal application. It's only X, Y and Z coordinates in the file. And then we open the MeshLab application and open the file, import it and it will show us a point cloud in the MeshLab. So there we have it, each dot represents one depth information and, and whole 3D scan is right there. It, it contains about 300,000 individual depth points at this stage. As we now have a very affordable 3D scanner, all kinds of things are possible. We could use it along with a 3D printer to model different prototype parts. Here we have one part that I have printed with my 3D printer. It's a custom support for cycle analyst display. I designed it in Alibre and printed with MakerBot Cupcake CNC do-it-yourself uh, kit 3D printer. As this is a Supermoto class electric uh, racing motorcycle, it didn't have suitable places for standard cycle analyst mount, so I had to make my own mount for it. So, combination of 3D scanning and 3D printing is very good for the prototyping uses uh, I, I'm using them. Here we have also one part that would benefit from 3D modeling and 3D scanning. It's the back fork. Uh, it was pretty difficult to measure the 
So I think Afro Doublet 3D scanning is finally here. As you can see, the results are more, more than good enough for, for the uh, initial 3D scans. And if you Google for Open Kinect, you will find many good examples and good open software to start your own experiments. Good luck and thanks for all those wonderful persons who have made this possible. Bye bye.